So, hey guys, it is Monday, November, I don't know, no, oh wait, no, it's November 7th. Um, so I decided I'm going to be doing like weekly vlogs from Monday to Friday. Um, like I guess I'll just kind of take you guys with me. And yeah, so right now I am watching some Bridget Nielsen. <laughs> I love her. Um, she's probably one of my favorite YouTubers. Um, and then I am just going to chill. I just got home from work. I had a four hour day today, which I am so grateful for. Um, I worked the drive through at Panera. You can see my drawings back there. Um, yeah, it's a lot of fun. I love the people I work with. Um, yeah. So I'm just gonna chill here for a little while and then eat dinner and get ready for bed. So yeah, I will either talk to you guys later or see you tomorrow when I'm on break. Hi guys, so it is now, oh you can see, <laughs> it is now 7.20ish and I just ate dinner, watched some TV with my mom, um, and I am about to do some stretches and then go take a shower and get ready for tomorrow because I am working until 7.45, which I am super nervous about, but I think it'll be okay. So yeah. I think I might show you guys my stretching routine. Um, I don't know, I might talk through it. I might just throw on some music in the clip. Or yeah, so let's just see what I decide to do. So now it's 7.36 and I just finished my stretching and I did a little mini ab workout because I don't have time to do what I would usually do since I want to go to bed early tonight. Um, I just did planks. I did a front plank and then two side planks, one on each side. Held it for a minute each and that works your abs really well. So yeah, I think maybe one day I'll film a workout routine, but yeah, so I, th I guess I'll show you guys how I take my makeup off. Um, I do wear very minimali minimalistic makeup. I just do concealer, powder, and then use my blush and bronzer for eyeshadow. So yeah. Um, so yeah. Okay. So to take it off, I am going to grab my baby wipes. Handy dandy little things. That's also a really cheap makeup remover that you can use. Yeah, um, and then I have some coconut oil. I use that to take everything off and then I go over it with the baby wipes. This with one hand. Um, I'm just going to scoop some out. Oh yeah, make sure you wash your hands also before you do this, which I didn't do. So yeah. This is definitely a hack and it also makes your eyelashes longer. These are not false eyelashes. They're my natural lashes, <laughs> believe it or not. Take off my eyes, grab the baby wipe, because this will make your eyes tear. A little bit, but it doesn't irritate them like a normal makeup remover would. And use your ring finger when you're doing this because it's a lot 
gentler and it doesn't tug on your eye. So, yeah. so how was your day today? Just comment down below and tell me. Like, do you guys have jobs? Do you work? Like, what do you do? Um, do you stay at home and play video games? I am taking the baby away and going over. Do you go to school? Like, what do you do? Um, I'm out of school, thankfully. Um, I think one day I'll film a video on why I do not like public school and just school in general. Because <laughs> I have some very, very strong opinions that I feel like I need to share. And just share my story with the public school system. But yeah. Um, let me see. So during the day, I work at Panera. The one that I work at has a drive-thru. I'm taking baby away. I'm going over. It has a drive-thru. My boss likes to keep me in the drive-thru. Where occasion occasionally... <laughs> I will do table runner and dining room. It's a lot of fun, but dining room is so much work. There's so much you have to learn in order to do it, but I mean, it's worth it though. Like, I really appreciate the customers who are super nice and grateful for all the work that you do. So I want to talk about independence really quickly because I know a lot of people struggle with that and especially if you're in school right now or in a shit relationship, it's hard to find that independence but meditation helps a lot with that. It helps to clear your head and keep you grounded and you start to listen and get to know yourself a lot better. Um, like, I know myself at a soul level <laughs> right now. I've been, been meditating for a year, and I do it every day, twice a day. Let's see. I'm going to film a video in December about that on my meditation experiences one year later. So you can definitely, you know, subscribe and keep a watch for that. So yeah, I'm going to say goodbye to you guys right now because I'm going to go hop in that shower and then get ready for bed and I'm going to end this vlog here so I will talk to you all tomorrow. So yeah, bye. Hey guys, it is now Wednesday, November 9th. Yeah. Um... I am wearing the same sweater I did on Monday night because it's comfy. I like to sleep in it. Um, it's 8.19. That glare. <laughs> um, I am just drinking some water and I'm waiting for my tea to heat up. And I'm going to have some tea with lemon in it. And then I'm going to have some oranges and a ton of fruit for breakfast. Because I'm not feeling so well. I worked really late last night. And I don't know. It's really hard because I can't eat or take care of myself if I'm working nine hours. And yeah, it's not feasible. <laughs> but I gotta do what I gotta do right now. So, yeah. I will update you in a little bit. So, this is my breakfast. That's my tea. It's all natural. And I just put some lemon juice in it. So, I am having some vitamin C to try and 
help me feel better. <laughs> but yeah, I think I just need to meditate and I'll feel better. <laughs> but yeah, I hope you guys have a great day and I will catch up with you in a little while. Yeah.